G'day mate, welcome back to Final Upgrade with me, Jenny. So today's episode, today's episode, I want to get into that black gold. I want to get into oil, I want to get some plastic running. Uh, the game's also complaining about map view, map view, map view. This planet over here, uh, Mars, wants to have some fuel. So again, that comes with oil. So we got a few things we're going to play with. But before I do that, I'm going to do some optimization. So... We have this one set up with, it can do multiple different types. At the moment we have supply and demand, supply and demand, supply and demand. We have a very, very large demand for copper ingots. Uh, if we go back out to map view and we select copper ingots, we can see we've got a demand of 200 up here, a demand of 50 down here, and a supply of 18 because this is super, super slow. So what we're going to do is we're going to just quickly... Hang on, get this lined up, set you, and you, and i got to do this again and again, and you, and you to copper, uh, demand, 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 we're going to set you to be copper, uh, copper, copper, and copper uh bring this up we're gonna set you to be copper copper uh, that was the wrong one we want to change you to copper ore close copper ore copper ore and copper ore okay try that again set you to be copper you to be copper and you to be copper and then we can set you to be ingots you to be ingots obviously with the other two uh stations already handling our iron needs we're pretty good for iron right at the moment uh so we set you to supply 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 and supply we'll also set these guys up to supply just in case we have something that needs some copper somewhere along the way we'll see uh and we're gonna leave that running and that should hopefully get our... Oh, no, actually, it would help if I set recipes on these. Uh, I sort of wish there was a way for these to auto-set recipes. Like, you know, obviously, if it finds copper right above it, it just starts producing copper ingots. That'd be really nice. Uh, but, yeah, we're going to set that up. That should hopefully fix some of our problems. In the meantime, uh, as I said, I want to go to the tech tree. We're going to unlock oil harvesting, which we've already done. We're going to do plastic plate because we need a couple of those being delivered. And let's go find a map. We want to go to oil. Oil and pla oh, plastic obviously comes from oil. So we want to go here and back into our tech tree. Wrong button. Tech tree. Plastic. Build station. This comes from a predefined station. Okay. Predefined. Pretty happy. Pretty okay. Not so great. Uh... Press the play. Thank you very much. Auto route. You can have some iron. That should get done just about instantly because we have a crap ton of iron built up down here. In the meantime, as I was saying, I want to go to blueprints. Uh, that's the plastic station. Okay. Has a couple of tanks up here. Has one, two, three, four, five, six machines. Six machines. Six machines is a perfectly reasonable amount. As you can see, uh, at maximum tech level, it does all right. Set to current tech level. Yeah, it's a little bit slower. Um, so what I want to do is I want to search custom stations, please. I would like a plastic station Mark II. Um, yes, because my machines are really slow. So to get around that, I have many, 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 many machines. They're still slow, don't get me wrong. They're still super, super, super slow. But I've got lots of them. Are you even working? Stop. Edit. You say you're working. Save. Run simulation. Max speed. Hey! So yeah, even at my pathetic tech speed, uh, they're, they're still going to produce at an all right speed. So we want to build one of these. Uh, out of 100% iron, please, we're going to dump that right here. Uh, we're going to call this a plastic station. 
we're not paying Earth for the construction. Thank you very much. We're going to go over here. We're going to grab all our construction ships. You go to there. You go to there. You go to there. Bring the power ship over as well. Uh, ships and station list. Uh, ships. Construction ship. You. That button? Yeah, that button brings it to us, which is exactly what we want to do. And we want to say, you built, you built, you built, you built. And off they go. Okay, obviously it's going to take a second or two to put this together, but um, with, what's that? 8, 16, 32, 32 little robots going nuts. It shouldn't take too long. Uh, we've finished iron. I can collect that. I still can't do circuits because we haven't unlocked the technology yet. But speaking of technology, the next thing I want to do is I want to do fuel from oil. Okay, because that's going to be important too. I want to be able to start having fuel because we do have one particular station that needs fuel already. And then I want electricity because that's the point. At the point we can start making our own electricity, we are self-sufficient. We don't have to deal with Earth anymore uh, unless we want a ship made in a hurry or we want ship with tech that we don't have. Yes, yes, yes. Uh, so yeah, we have the hints over here that is telling us what to do. We also have our planet orders over here. We can see copper ingots have been done. Circuits, circuits, circuits. I can't touch. Gold is maybe occasionally getting done. Fuel's not getting touched. And plastic plate's not getting touched either just yet. So once this has got some power in it. Yeah, just keep, just attach a power for yourself. Poor little shippy. All right, we're going to jump you home. We're going to recharge you. Uh, recharge. Yeah, we're slowly going broke. Uh, yeah, we did that. Yeah, we did that. That can go away. That can go away. And you want gold. Is that not set up? That is not set up. We will set that up. It's it's just not going to happen currently because all our gold is disappearing onto our construction ships. Um, but you know, maybe in the future, maybe possibly. Uh, unfortunately, you're full of crap that you can't dump. Can I? Okay. Drops are items to space. Silicon ore. Yes. That whoop, frees the ship up to do other things. And meanwhile, so, you know, you, you can just throw things to orbit. They'll obviously crash back down to the planet, I guess. Um, it's fine. Yeah, it's perfectly fine. They'll come back, I'm sure. We just harvest more. But it frees that ship back up. Because at the moment, it's sitting there full of silicon trying to dump them in here, which is not going to work, obviously. Uh, what's that say? Uh, we've done the copper ore. You want oil? Uh, map. Oil. You can get oil from here. Yes. All right, we'll go back to our plastic station, which is halfway there. Uh, we want you to demand copper to all close. So we can also set up oil. Demand, 1K. Yeah. Yeah, it's, it's a bit of a hungry station. Uh, but as soon as this is built, it'll start producing plastic on mass and that's one of the things we're definitely going to want on top of that we need to get a fuel station which is probably going to require more oil so we're going to be doing a little bit of black gold hunting this episode uh we just need to have this construction finished First delivery of oil done, and the machines start kicking in action. Voila, we have plastic. A lot of plastic, but a little bit of plastic. It's a start, it's a start. So, we've started mass producing, whoop. Started mass producing plastic. Uh, we should, should get us out of trouble. Should get us, let us fill a few more orders. Uh, so with that done, we're gonna go out to map view. We're gonna obviously select plastic plate. And we're gonna say, you want, uh, oh, okay. Hey, all right, so we need to resize that. And add a resource zone, plastic plate, 
obviously from here to here it might not have been completely fleshed out in 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 the blueprint builder but you know uh it got mostly fleshed out uh okay so you want demand copy to all and now they've all got a little blue border around them yes yes okay all right so cat nope nope Nope, 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 okay, map view, map view. If we bring our oil, we can see we're demanding 2K, so it's just gonna take a little while, and plastic plate, we're gonna see we're already gonna fill that one, and that one's not far behind. So, yes, mega stations do wonderful jobs of getting things done quickly, and I'd say efficiently, but maybe not always. All right, next thing we want is we want a fuel station, which is gonna require oil. So we want for our next, I think it's going to be this planet. This planet has a good oil reserve. We could use the same oil reserve in multiple places, but it's sort of better to space things out if possible. I was still picking up ships. All right. Uh, what's that say? Iron ingots. Iron ingots, low energy. Yeah, you're out of power. Unfortunately, there's a tiny battery, so they're not going to last long. Uh, there's the other construction ship I wanted. You, come here. And your ship, come here too. Uh, we've finished plastic plate already. You want iron ingots. We have plenty of those here. You can have a supply from that one as well. Uh, construction, 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 construction. Uh, that one, which is already partly done. Iron ingots we just fixed. Uh, you're almost finished with oil, and you still have no gold. Uh, how are we up to... Actually, where are we up to the copper ingots? They're all done. Okay. K. We're going to change you over to gold. Gold. Uh, gold. And gold. Uh, we're going to... Hang on. Disabled. Change you... No. Clear zone of other items. Yes. Change... We're going to demand. There we go. Alright. Uh, we're going to ship our ingots from there to there. Yep, so it's full. Uh, we're going to... Clear zone. Clear zone. Clear zone. Yeah, we're going to throw all that overboard. Uh, we're going to change you over to do gold, change you over to do gold, change you over to do gold, uh, change you over to do gold, because obviously it has a better profit per minute. Same time, go back to the... Uh, actually, no, they'll process through. They'll process through, they can become um, copper ingots, and the gold's only going this far, so it's fine. Um, we're not actually processing the, the, the gold into actual ingots. All right, so we want to go back to there. We wanted a brand new station. Uh, again, uh, we're going to use one of my custom stations. Actually, hang on. We wanted to do fuel. Yes, fuel station. Uh, doesn't look ridiculous at all. It is literally tanks on the top, a whole bunch of pipes, a whole bunch of refineries into uh, into a whole bunch of tanks. It's it's pretty basic. It's pretty simple. It's been really designed to max out our soul range, and we're going to dump one of those there. Now, as you can see, because this was a... This is actually from my own save. So, this started out as the basic station, which I then upgraded, upgraded, upgraded. I actually ran out of copper. I ran out of iron during the building of this. So, this has a mix of iron and a mix of copper. If I switch that to that, then hit build, and then dump it down there, it's going to be fuel station. And... No... Oh, uh, and now it no longer needs copper. Um, as soon as we get rich in another resource, I'd like to build a station out of something other than iron, because it just gets boring looking at iron all the time. But, you know, at the moment, we're poor. We're poor. We're poor. Uh, and gold stations are a little bit too much of a task. Uh, nickel. I do have nickel, don't I? I have nickel. Oh, that's the enemy. Yeah! Supply the enemy. Uh, they'll give us money. Uh, priority number five. So we're going to right click on that and set a higher priority with a minimum batch size and a default batch size. Oh, 
Oh, because that was the problem. If you set the minimum... Previously, there was only a minimum. So, as I said, the, the devs hard at work doing updates constantly. It's one of those games that, you know, you probably should read the patch notes if you haven't played it for a couple of days. Um, so, yeah, minimum batch size used to be the, the norm in the game. And now they've added, the devs obviously added a default batch size. Because I had an issue where I got up to larger ships, but then everything was still moving around in batches of 25. Obviously, 25 is not a lot when a ship moves like 200. So... Yeah, you can now set a default batch size and then not have to worry about it. But yes, we're going to ship our ingots up here instead and feed the enemy because they'll still pay us money. All right, so we're going to have four construction ships get this bad boy up and running. This one is going to have us uh, give us a whole bunch of fuel in exchange for oil. So again, we're going to have to find another oil depot at the same time. Demand and supply. Uh, oil. Yeah. Our, our, our first station is... Where is it? Plastic station. Has not a lot of oil in it. All right. Uh, iron is low in energy. Yep. And fuel station is low in energy. Well, fuel stations are meant to be low in energy. It just got built. Come on. Power. Thank you. Yes. Iron Station, I am actually going to refill. I want to keep this one running. In fact, I want to keep all the stations running for just the moment. But the Iron Ingot one, we're hopefully going to be able to retire fairly soon. All right. Cash them up. We're not really losing money. We're not really gaining money. The one thing we are gaining is experience points, left, right, and center. Uh, close. Close. Close, close, close. You're done with your plastic plate. Now you want coolant. Okay, coolant is a recipe we don't have unlocked yet, but we'll get to it. Iron ingot, really? You were the station I was just talking about shutting down. All right, we're gonna top it up this time. This is a station I do want to uh, do depreciate uh blow up sometime in the not too distant future all right again we are just got to wait for some construction it doesn't matter how many th ships i throw at this thing it's it's gonna take a while oh actually we can already set up oil imports please that says supply of zero why does it say supply of zero demand oil because these are all partially wrong Yes, okay. Build. Copy tank settings. Uh, supply. That'll look to be fine. Alright, we're gonna bring up oil and we'll dump that into there to start us off. Uh, yeah, we're, we're gonna have to do something about having a few extra ships flying around to bring in more and more oil. Bring in more liquids outright because liquid transport is a different type of transport to any other type of transport that we've built so far. So there's going to be some tweaks that need to be done. All right. Again, we're just going to do a short time lapse and get this built. All right. Here we are with one completed station. And if we go to oil and we can see there is exactly zero ships delivering liquid because they're too busy trying to fill this one. Uh, so we need a couple more ships. So we're going to find... Nope, that's being used. We're going to go here. Uh, jump. Jump. Uh, actually, we'll jump you and we'll jump you and we'll jump you. And we'll go to here first and we'll go blueprints. Uh, ships, uh, liquid harvester, that's a cheapie, that's one I've custom made. So, we have liquid harvesters, liquid carriers down here. Um, and these are okay, like, they're okay, they're nothing special, they, they've got some decent liquid car uh, uh, containers, then I have this baby. This baby uh, carries basically every po everything it possibly can. Why is there two chunks of iron in the corner? Oh. Okay. Uh. 
delete. Done. Save. So we're going to build one right there. Uh, nope. And blueprints. Build a second one right there. Nope. Have you build that one, you build that one. And then we're going to go over this space, uh, th th this planet. We're going to build one there. And at the same time, blueprints build another one right there. So we're going to get those ships up and running. They'll just take just but a second. And then we should be good. Uh, that's going to be a whole lot of construction complete, construction complete, construction complete, construction complete. Iron ingots, low energy. No, we fixed that one. Hopefully we've got enough iron on board to get them both just built. I hope. Now you don't need robots to... Or do you need robots? I can't remember actually. I don't think you actually need robots to harvest liquids. So I think these ships are a little bit... I think I'm wasting a little bit of effort having... Um, the robot stations in there. I don't actually think I need them. Uh, auto logic, uh, harvest routes, buy. Auto logic, liquid harvest routes. Hello? Oh, I'm out of routes. Okay. So that's another thing. You can only have one ship uh, harvesting liquids from a planet at a time. So it does mean I need to do that and that and that and that and that and come on oh, i haven't claimed that one yet okay and at the same time i need to do that no not that one and that one and that one and that one and that one yeah things are gonna get a little bit messy yeah yeah oh, okay we're gonna jump you across to there uh, give you a touch of energy and give you a touch of energy as well uh, auto logic harvest liquids uh, auto logic harvest liquids all right uh, take our energy ship back down here and top it up again as you can see we're losing money like we're doing a great job, but we're spending so much on energy to keep the lights on. Uh, it's 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 not going well. So uh, oil is finished. That'll get us some cash back. You need I need fuel. We are producing fuel, so that should be okay. At the same time, you're producing. We're now producing a lot of fuel. Honestly, honestly, as long as we can keep these tanks running, we're going to keep producing a heap of fuel, and we should be able to keep everything nice and happy. Uh, energy train, energy to construct. That one's done. That one's done. That one's done. But in the list of the planet's orders, uh, one of them wants coolant. And we want to try and get ourselves towards free power. So if we go to electricity from fuel and we press Y on that, we can see that did not work. Power generator? No. Okay, fuel from that, which doesn't give us okay fine unlock it first does that now tell us no the y is meant to tell us uh how to build electricity from fuel and unfortunately it's not doing a very good job that's hydrogen i don't care about hydrogen i care about fuel uh electricity all right so the y button's slightly broken yeah it's 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 broken on uh, electricity from fuel. Alright, so if we build... Oh, no, 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 no. Uh, let's find... So, we're making fuel right here. So, obviously, somewhere close to it, like right there it do. If we go to that, we go to that. We go build station. That's what it would look like. And then if we go into blueprints, it should show us what the station looks like. So, we can see that this is obviously fuel. Uh, let's go with edit. Edit. Okay. Copy. Uh, call this temp. Okay, 
so we can see this uses fuel and this uses coolant. So we're going to use coolant and plumb, plumb them both into a machine, a power generator. So obviously we need fuel and we need cool coolant and that should provide us power. Okay, great. Except we already know the default builds, they work. They're just not great. Uh, delete, 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 remove. Yes, I don't want temp. Okay, so we need coolant. Now coolant, if we go back to our technology tree, coolant from water. I think that's what we're gonna need first which means a coolant station, which is gonna be really simply water uh, water into coolant. So we need to see where our best water is. Turns out it's right here or here. So we're gonna to go to this planet, which looks like an icy moon. Perfect. Uh, build menu. Nope, nope, nope. Blueprint menu. Go away, build menu. Blueprint menu. We're gonna look for stations, custom, uh, coolant. Yeah, you might notice it takes some uh, design features from my um, 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 refinery station. So, uh, same story, it's got the copper there in the background because, yeah. All right, so we're gonna build that. Uh, I'm gonna leave the copper in there and we're gonna stamp that crap right there. We're gonna go coolant. We're not gonna pay the $67,000. Uh, we're gonna grab our construction ships. Actually, I'm gonna go K. You are going to need some copper on you. Yep, you are now the one ship that carries copper. Uh, you're going to go there. You're going to go there. You're going to go there. And you're going to go there. And we're going to start mass building this thing. Now, if you saw very, very quickly, I have a bigger and better battery down here. Uh, once they build enough, that one, bigger and better battery. Catch is I don't know how to actually build a bigger... Well, I don't have the resources to build a bigger and better battery just yet. Uh, where's our power station... Uh, power ship? Uh, so, we're going to have to deal with just the two jumbo batteries that I have currently and hope that that's enough. It's probably enough for right now. Ah, uh, the fuel is done. Silicon. Turns out we already make silicon. Excellent. That's one done. And you want iron shells well we're not quite at the point where we have war ammunition yet that shall be a future episode so again we're gonna have to get this built it's gonna take but just a moment uh can we go to supply and demand yet order no no i need one of these tanks to actually be built as soon as i have one tank built we can start uh getting the Water being shipped in, at which point the system can at least turn on. All right, there we go. Water. Okay, uh, deposit, 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 deposit. More deposits. That's not my planet. And more deposits. Okay, so that should start getting the water shipped in whilst we wait for this thing to get built, which should start pumping out coolant. Uh, speaking of coolant, who wanted coolant? You did. All right, so again, another quick time lapse where we wait for no resource copper. Oh yeah, because you don't have copper. You could build iron something. Yeah. What? Oh, fine. All right, stop being like that. We'll change you out. You can have some copper then. You happy now? Bye. Occasionally get hung up because they want to build this tiny bit of copper here. Oh, okay, this giant chunk of copper across the top. Well, there you go. Yeah, we're, it's it's a little bit of a mixed match, match station. It's it's fine. It's just whatever materials I happen to have at the time, which was not a lot. Anyway, like I said, uh, we're going to let this uh, build in the background and uh, do a quick time lapse, and I'll be back. And as you can now see, we're now having liquid, liquid water come in, liquid coolant come out, and we're one step closer to finally becoming uh, independent, to finally having some, being able to combine our fuel up here with our coolant down here. 
probably in one of these two stations here. Uh, let's go with that one. You have water, carbon, cool. Uh, you have water, nickel, carbon, and silicon. So probably this one, as it seems the most useless out of the two. Uh, actually, we finished another contract. We finished the coolant contract already. You want more uh, shells as well, which we can't afford. Uh, construction complete, construction complete, uh, energy trade complete, energy trade complete, energy trade complete, energy trade complete. So we've made some good progress. It means tomorrow, next episode, next episode. I won't say tomorrow because I have no idea whether it's actually going to be tomorrow or not. But next episode, we shall actually look at trying to get a, a uh, fuel station up and running. I do have a pretty blueprint somewhere. Broken. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, Power Mark 2. Power Mark 2 seems about right. Uh, except I don't have any of those batteries in there. So, yes. Uh, might need to modify things between episodes. At the same time, I think I might, between episodes, go for a bit of an explore. Because there's still a whole bunch of the galaxy we can't see yet. So, with all that said, I'm going to leave it right here. Thank you guys so much for watching. Do hope you've enjoyed. We're getting poor, but in theory, if we get a uh, power up and running, that's been our main cost so far. If we click on this, we can see... Uh, yeah, I'm spending lots and lots of money on ships and power ships and power lots and lots of money on both ships and power so with that said uh yeah we're, we're well into the negative with that that said i'm gonna leave it here thank you guys so much for watching do hope you're enjoying i'm gonna see you guys in the next episode where we hopefully hopefully can become independent from earth and have our own power network up and running but with that said that's where i'm gonna leave it thank you guys so much for watching do hope you're enjoying and i'll see you guys in the next episode all right bye <laughs>